Yeah. And free white sands, you know? Seriously crazy all that's happened in two years. The country of Petria makes a return in the prequel to Road 96, appropriately titled Road 96 Mile Zero. You assume the role of Zoe, a character that players will often encounter in the original game as they make their way to the border. This prequel showcases her life in the luxurious town of White Sands before she eventually ran away to set out on the open road. Hi, and welcome to a very special Sonia show. I'm here in White Sands, Petria's most luxurious community, where in the upcoming days, President Tyrak is set to make a big announcement from Presidential Park. Will it? Road 96 Mile Zero changes a few things from the original as it focuses more on making choices than keeping your characters alive or being detained since Zoe still lives in White Sands and doesn't have to worry about surviving on the road. In addition, the character's status bar has been replaced by a meter representing Zoe's certainty about a situation, such as thinking that the Black Brigade Revolution Group was responsible for the 1986 Petrio border attacks as she begins to believe that they were not involved in the attacks at all. Instead, it may have been the fault of the controversial president, Tyrak. Throughout these choices, Zoe will begin sliding towards one of these groups to side with. Although, for those that have played the original, you already know where Zoe's story will end. Still, Zoe isn't the only playable character, as we are introduced to her friend Kaito, who is a significant factor in the overarching narrative. This is where players are introduced to a new feature called Musical Rides. During the game, Zoe and Kaito will enter a musical sequence similar to other rhythm games like Musical Racer, but on roller skates or a skateboard instead. During these moments, they must dodge obstacles and navigate through the stylish world from their point of view. In the event that you hit something though, you'll be forced back a short distance and must repeat that section of the level. However, don't get too frustrated if you get stuck a few times as there are options to skip the rides altogether. This will enable you to continue the story. However, for people coming in after playing Road 96, these levels may take some getting used to. Other mini games make a return which help add to the dark comedic humor of the experience, such as firing a ton of newspapers towards random civilians around White Sands or hammer out their frustrations with life. While Zoe is the main character in the sequences outside of the musical rides, Road 96 Mile Zero puts a lot of focus on Kaito. We find out that Kaito lives in the lower section of White Sands and is still dealing with the devastating loss of his friend Aya, as well as trying to understand his growing friendship with Zoe, which soon gets put to the test when Zoe becomes suspicious of Kaito after he starts to hang out with people who are implied to be the Black Brigade. Further, Zoe isn't the only character from Road 96 to make a return, as Sonia Sanchez, a reporter from The Sonia Show, is Zoe's neighbor, and Adam, who has a relationship with both of these characters and receives more depth. Other characters also appear in a blink it or miss it moment. Newer characters can also be interacted with in hilarious or meaningful ways. One being Cyrus, a Tai Chi instructor. Another is Colton, President Tyrek's bratty son and his stressed bodyguard Frank. Despite Road 96 Mile Zero being less open world than the original and the inclusion of a musical rhythm system switching up gameplay elements, this is shaping up to be a charming follow up to Road 96. We get to explore more of the characters' backstories and their relationships. The choice system also adds a new layer of interest as players can now directly affect Zoe's actions before the events of the first game. I'm definitely looking forward to meeting more characters and experiencing how the narrative shapes in the full game. Row 96 is coming to PS4, PS5, Xbox One, Series X, Switch, and PC on April 4th, 2023. Thanks for watching. Please read the full preview at NoisyPixel.net. NoisyPixel is run by a group of gamers who work hard to deliver news, reviews, previews, and more. Please subscribe to keep up with all our future content. Noisy pixel.